Hey everybody, Joe from Libby Fish here, and uh, today is a nice day as far as sunshine goes. Also a nice day if you're into ice fishing. The temps have been really, really low in the single digits, and that hard water is starting to form. So I'm out and about driving around all the way from the North End Anchor Bay down to Metro, and I'm going to give you a nice report, let you know where people are setting up, let you know how the ice fishing's going, and even get on some hard water myself. All right, I got to cut the recording now because the sun is blinding me when I concentrate on the driving, and uh, see you in a minute. Welcome or welcome back to Live to Fish. I've been driving all over town, uh, all the way up from the north end of Anchor Bay, all the way down here to Lake St. Clair Metro Park. I spent all that time driving, burning some gas so you don't have to. And no, I'm not asking for gas money, but do me a favor, hit that subscribe button, make sure you subscribe to Live to Fish. If there's one way you can support me, that would be it. And a special thanks to all of you that are already subscribed. Thanks to you in 2022, I met my goal of 2,000 subscribers. And now I'm shooting for 3,000 and I hope you'll help me get there. Without further ado, let's get right down to those ice reports and take a look at the conditions along Anchor Bay and Lake St. Clair. First up north around Fairhaven DNR launch and also around the raft there was some ice and some people out fishing but just south of there down at uh, Bobby Max Bayside there were people out on the ice as you can see there there's a shanty out there some people walking but uh, I'll tell you what there was open water everywhere else just south of there so a little bit sketchy. A little farther south down in Rudisell Park in New Baltimore, a lot of skim, a lot of open water. Same thing with downtown New Baltimore. Downtown New Baltimore was full of skim, a lot of open water, nothing that was safe or walkable. Now that may change with the single digit weather temps we're going to have coming up here, so I will keep you posted. I skipped over Brandenburg Park because it was really, there was nothing there. There's a lot of skim, uh, open water, but south of there at the DNR launch over at Selfridge, there's definitely people out in their shanties. They're all along the canal area, but outside of that, it's open water. The, uh, the main lake has not frozen over yet, but again, come those uh, single digit temps that are coming, you might see things change there. And as I stated before, my final destination is right here at Lake St. Clair Metro Park, where I'm meeting up with Rich from Owl's Nest Outdoors. He's treating me to the shelter of his shanty, and we're going to see if we can't get on some fish on the hard water. That's right, it's time for my first ice fishing outing in over 30 years. Let's see what we can do. Let's go. Safety first, definitely bringing the spud. How's it going? Knock, knock. Hey. What's up, Rich? How are you? Good, how about you? Good. Oh, you all set up? Uh, you cool. or Good to see you, man. Nice to see you. It's, uh, wow, is that stacked up? Nice. God, I'm fine. Hey, fish is a fish. It's the first one of the year. Good deal. Little guy. So fish. Beauty. Back in there. Cool. I think I got him. Hand fishing. Yeah. All right. Nice. First ice fishing fish He's in 30 plus years. Really? Yep. Yeah, I haven't been on the ice in forever. Very cool. It's tiny, but it's a fish. First fish of 2023. See you. There you have it, my first fish of 2023 and my first fish on ice in over 30 years. Special thanks to Rich out at Owl's Nest Outdoors for having me out. And if you want to see more of the ice fishing experience, go ahead and check out his channel. I'm going to leave a link to his channel down in the video description below. So will this be the last ice? You know, I'm really not sure, but we'll find out. And I'll definitely keep an eye out and keep you posted right here on Live to Fish. So until next time, be safe, be well, and as always, Live to Fish. Take care, everybody.